Alright, so this is the video about the um, w um, World at War zombie maps um, at COD 5 that are remade in Black Ops. As you can see here, I'm at the main menu and I'm uh, in uh, the zombies menu. And so this is a video is about the zombie maps that are remade from COD 5 for Black Ops. And the way you get those is by going into the Hardened Edition. And so those are all of the zombie maps total. So those first three are, um, the first three on the list are from, uh, are the ones that originally come with the regular edition of Black Ops. But the last four are the ones that are remade for Black Ops from COD 5. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you the first one, Notchter Untoten. Um, but um, uh, the others are also very good, and I highly recommend playing, um, I highly recommend getting the Hardened Edition if you can. So here it is. Alright, so... As you can see here, um, uh, this is the Nachtstern Toten like you remember it. Um, you can still buy the same guns off the walls, still like same number of entry points. It's basically the same map. It's just that um, I think there's like newer sort, um, like better animations and things like that. And um, uh, you, the pistol you start out with is shinier, but I think it's basically about as good. Um, and you can get str and you can get new weapons from Black Ops in the um, uh, in the mystery boxes. And um, um, I'm gonna buy one right there. Um, and uh, they also have things that were included later in Black Ops in Zombies for all of the maps. Um, and so, for instance, there's player commentary, um, um, there's the, um, computer commentary from those, um, from the four, um, from, uh, the four soldiers now on all of the maps, um, uh, except on all of the original zombie maps. As you can see here, I'm using the, uh, China Lake grenade launcher. It's definitely not like a great weapon that you should use like a lot of the time, but if you if you get in the mystery box and it's you're not too far in, you can stick with it for a little while because it, as you can see here it, it works when there's not too many zombies. Um and an important thing is to fire it at zombies who aren't too close to you because like if a zombie's right in your face you shouldn't use the china lake because it might kill them but also seriously hurt you um, and so uh... this is the this is black ops this is not cod five um, as you can see there i just got the rpk which is, um, you know, I'm not like the most hardcore COD player. I think it's one of the best games out there, and I really like it. But um, I, I don't I'm know like every single weapon by heart, so I'm not quite sure if that if the RPK is from COD 5 or COD 6, but I'm pretty sure it's from COD 6. Come to think of it, I think the majority of the weapon weapons that cycle through the mystery box are actually from... COD 6, um, I mean, Black Ops, not COD 6, um, uh, and as you can see here, um, uh, I am using the Python, which is basically the new version of the Magnum in this. Um, if you haven't played Black Ops, the Python's really good dual-wielded and multiplayer, um, as a secondary weapon, anyway. This is basically the same map, but you can get, like, but there's definitely the new Black Ops weapons. Um, and they've a axed some of the older weapons, like the, like, I don't think you can get the Pish anymore on, um, Darice. Um, uh, and, like, I'm sorry for getting the name. I don't think you can get, like, that big black machine gun on this map anymore. Um, and there you have it.